Hey guys, the Fiendfolio mod recently got a new content update that came with some cool new items. One of them is the new Quality 4 Secret Room item, Arrow's Crazy Slots. It is a single time use active that will be consumed after you fully used it. The first press of the active button will start a 3 digit slot over Isaac's head. Each subsequent use will lock in one of the three numbers from left to right, while making the remaining ones cycle a bit faster every time, until all three of them are locked. You already saw the result. Finishing your roll will gift you a free item, but not just any random one. It will be based on the item ID you've just rolled with the three slots. The crazy slots can create any single item in the game, even story items. It also doesn't care about your progress or if the item you want is even unlocked in the first place. The first and second slot are actually slow enough to force the first two numbers of the item ID you want if you time it well. The third one however is really fast, good luck on that one. The slot over your head will stay there until you finish the roll, even if you leave the room or lose the slot machine somehow, especially the latter one is not recommended. Once you started the roll, you have to finish it. There is no way to reset it if you messed up one of the first numbers. You have to be patient and commit to the gamble. You can't even force the numbers of your choice by pause buffering, because the slot keeps running when the game is paused. There is no way to cheat or cheese this item. However, there are many IDs that are not assigned to an item in the game. For example, in this case I tried to create a non-existing item with the evil ID 666. Whenever you roll one of these invalid IDs, the arrow's crazy slots will teleport you to the current floor's I am arrow room instead of giving you a free item. Keep in mind that there are tons of secret room layouts that contain items, often on top of free pickups and other useful stuff. Fiendfolio error rooms can even contain glitched items. If you want to force an error room, you have to go for one of these invalid IDs or an ID bigger than the number of items in the game and mod combined. All things considered, Arrow's Crazy Slots is basically Fiendfolio's version of the death certificate. However, I must admit that it is very hard to force the ID you want. But there is something I notice when messing around with the timing. As you can see right here, if you quickly spam the item, the locked numbers will often be subsequent ones. You can make use of this by looking up an item that has an idea with at least the second and third digits being subsequent. A really good item to go for is C-section with the idea 678. Since you are probably wondering, no, the arrow's crazy slots doesn't have any special synergies. It does not interact with the car battery by giving you more items. The item also doesn't generate any special wisps with the Book of Virtues. In fact, it doesn't even generate one of the basic wisps. You just get the item and that's it. Also, a useless but fun fact, the arrow's crazy slots can also create a new arrow's crazy slots. If you want to try this just for fun, you would have to go for its ID of 925. The arrow's crazy slots is obviously not as powerful as death certificate, but it will probably lead to hilarious situations because of failed rolls into bad items. What do you think about the item? Let me know in the comments. Also, what item would you try to go for? Maybe there are some good item IDs next to each other to increase the chance for a good one. I really hope you enjoyed this item showcase and I hope to see you again in my next video. Bye! He's the number one Isaac! God's favorite son His flowing rose Reach down from